What is happening, guys? Cowboy here, and we're back. Heading on up to Eloise to try and find that life spring. Eleanor, did the exorcists know about this when they agreed to help Artorius? They couldn't have. The exorcists I know fought for a world where people could live their lives in happiness and peace. But then how do you explain the fact that the exorcists seem to accept what's going on? Maybe... That was just what I wanted to believe. It could be that Inominot suppression is also affecting the exorcists. Nope. You mean, Inominot might have taken control of their will and made them his tools? Completely believable. Exorcists are too hard-headed to be open to much persuasion. If I stayed with the Abbey, I might have accepted this world too. Thank you, Lafayette. It's your strength that protects my heart from wavering. You really think so? Of course I do. Have a little more self-confidence. <laughs> Guess it's a good thing I captured you then. That's true. I owe you my gratitude as well. Thank you. Seriously? Quite. To be able to express what's in my heart is a wonderful thing. You still drive me mad. But I can't disagree there. Even when not yet fully awakened, Inominot can extend his reach to the entire world. The other towns are probably in the same sorry state as the ones we've seen. Or perhaps even worse. Mogilu, is there some art that can awaken Malakim? What do you mean? Well, if I could just use the flames of purification properly... Even if you could alter reality with that power, you'd end up destroying yourself in the process. Do you want to awaken that badly? I need more power. For Velvet's sake? For her too, but I hate what the Abbey is doing. It's just wrong. This world of theirs is without any joy. I just... want to do everything I can to stop them. This is what I want, with my own free will. And I... I know of no such art. And even if I did, it wouldn't help you. Huh? You've already found strength in your heart. There's no magic that can make that stronger. What you need is to be ready and determined. And to be brave. I guess you're right. Thanks, Maki Lou. No thanks necessary. A hundred gold will cover it. <coughs> uh... You want me to pay you? Hey, good advice isn't free. What do I look like, a sidewalk psychiatrist? I'm a witch. She always has to be so difficult. Aguilu always trying to get paid. Out of my way, minions. To Heloise we go. Let's check to make sure. Yeah, okay, Port Zexon and then to Heloise. I wish you could get XP doing this, just like running through stuff, just like boo boop, boo boop, 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 boop. I mean, if I really wanted to power level, I could always just put combat on auto and have my controller just like run in circles or something. But I don't know. I feel like I'm at a I'm at a good good level for where content is right now. Walk with idol. Hoping the loot would be a little bit better, but apparently not. Good. It seems you're both still here inside me, then. It is not as though we desired these circumstances. We're only here because you ate us. I'll make no apologies. You wish to sacrifice us to the four elemental Empyreans, is that it? Yes. I won't apologize for that, either. It matters not. Your sins are nothing a mere apology could ever absolve. I know. 
At least you're aware of how selfish you are. Good for you, then. Remember this well, Lord of Calamity. No matter how many times I am reborn, I will act the same. As will I. I'll eat you again, then. And I as well. Did you say something? Just dreaming is all. But I know now how deep my sins run. Velvet, there's something I've wanted to talk to you about. It's... it's about the Therians. And about Lafayette. Let me guess. The link between us and Inominat. Yes. There's no way of knowing what will happen until we actually try, but... You don't have to worry about me. I said it before. Best just to blame all the wickedness of the world on the Lord of Calamity. Don't you try to shoulder all of this yourself! We exorcists are just as much at fault for letting things come to this. So let me ponder what to do about Kamoana and the rest. But you need to think about Lafiset. There, I've said my piece. I don't know which of us is more stubborn. Still, I've got to face the truth. I've got to tell him. What truth is she talking about? It's gotta suck being suppressed and up here. Oh, good. This place hasn't been suppressed yet. Oh, or not? Now look pretty We're lifeless. Loading. Give me a hand, will ya? No, they definitely look suppressed. Hey, you listening? Sorry. Something just feels weird. Like there's something tugging at my thoughts. Oh, uh, they're in the process of suppression. Yeah, I've been hearing a lot of that lately. But pull yourself together. Yeesh! Yet being the operative term here. We'd better get a move on. Benwick, don't leave Kamoana or Medissa's domain. Got it? The Therians are part of Inominat. They should be able to resist suppression to some extent. Aye, aye. You watch yourself too, first mate. Mount Killeraus is at the northern edge of Northgand. Bit of a trek. It'd be nice if we could resupply along the way. There's a town, Mercia, near the foot of the volcano. It faces the sea, but the currents lately have been too strong to approach it by water. However, the land route should still be clear. The whole continent has been getting colder of late, not just Northgand. Colder? Could it have something to do with Inominat? Or maybe it's because the elemental Empyreans are asleep. Both sound possible. But think too hard about the cold, and it'll give you the shivers. Yeah, but even so... Whatever the case, our course remains the same. We'll head to Mercio and work from there. Dude, if suppression hit this place, like, nothing would get done. People would just be like, it is cold out. Logic insists that I stay inside my house, where it is warm. Good luck, sailors, with unloading your ship. We will not be assisting today. Cold is not something I enjoy. Please, make a fire now, before my tits literally freeze off of my body. Real talk though, I could never live up north, man. Especially, like, I mean, I grew up in, like, New Jersey, and you get, you get a, a decent flow of seasons there. You know, like, we, we have some warm, we have some cold. Um, and then I went to college down in Florida, so I was down there for eight years. And uh, now I'm in Tennessee. In Tennessee, we get seasons, but, like, the cold, like, it doesn't really get cold, cold in Tennessee. Like, right around, like, late January, early February, we might get, like, a month or so where it's like, man, this is fucking chilly, but we don't, we don't get, like, you know, 
Washington, Oregon cold. Where do I gotta go anyway? Heading north through the Faldies route. Never mind, I should have just read that. Out of my way, bird. You as well, bug. Yeah, Tim! It's even colder here than last time! You're right. It was merely freezing before. Now it goes straight to the bone. Allow me to warm! Not Nessa. Uh, uh, oh? The stasis are going around? What? Choo! Oh, so cold. If it's this bad here, I dread to think of what the Guyberg ice field is like. The tundra past Mount Killerhouse? Is it really that cold? I've stayed up in the mountains many times for my training. With all the snow, I imagine it'd be pretty rough for a normal human. Why are you sneezing all of a sudden? Demons aren't supposed to feel cold. Nah, a snowflake just flew up my nose and... Achoo! You're sneezing too. My hair was blowing around and tickled my nose. But according to the old book I read, it isn't supposed to snow much around Guyberk. Because of lava from the volcano and the Earth's natural heat. I bet the book calls it Guyberk Plains too. Yeah, it says Mount Killerhouse was highly active and the area used to be famous for its hot springs. But now it's... Uh... What? Why are you all staring? They're all expecting you to sneeze, I think. Everyone else is doing it! Now give us a good show! Ah. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Sorry, everyone. No sneezes here. I'll practice for next time. Ah, oh, good grief. Alright, last time I was here this place was all blocked off. Maybe I've been partially in here? Because it shows a catch chest that's opened up. Hmm. Maybe I have been here. Ah, yes. It's the, uh, it's the area up ahead that's blocked, though. Out of my way, you basic bitches. Definitely a lot of Molochine around here. I'll finish this now. We're finished here. Let's understood. Let so many earrings that she needs to get mastery of.
this is the area that was blocked off. of survivability. Yeah, this is definitely not hot spring friendly anymore. <laughs> what is that? It's a guillotine? That's cool. I want to fight the guillotine monster. Stop and those are fists. some tanky bastards. It's only a bit further to the town of Mercio. And once we're past Mercio, we'll find our destiny on Mount Killaros. I know it's supposed to be cold here, but I didn't think it would be this cold. Reviving the elemental Empyreans is bound to alter this weather. <sighs> I'm not sure how much warmer it'll get in the time we'll still be alive. Keep moving. The cold and the climb don't matter. We have to move forward. We can't stop until the elemental Empyreans have been revived. Let's see the chest that I want. Not really looking to fight a bunch of these things at once. I wonder how long this place is. Oh, these are cool. Are we ready for this? We're weak to none, but they're resistant to water and weak to hidden arts. Jesus, the combo! Come <laughs> on. 
That was pretty badass. Whew. I thought we were done for. Damn. That was some ridiculous combo potential. I see the thing. I see it. I get over to there. How do I get down? Circle around. around here. I don't think we have a chance. Resistant to fire, really? I am on manual. Ah, get off of me, you douchebags. Oh, they pinned me in a corner. Y'all have a resurrect coming for me? She's trying to, but they're all over her. There we go, she's got it. Papa said distract them. You can do it. Okay, fuck this. Now that I'm sitting here in the fray, they can actually get their casting off. I still need I get mastery. Time for you. Two chests around here still. Where the hell are there two chests at? Not much to this area. That's a dead end. Overlook something in here? Gotta be over here somewhere. I was like, this isn't. A, this is a very small area. Uh, <laughs> I'm like, I'm. I'm a little baffled because there's two chests that. Should be here. I don't see where. 
got the one. We got that one. Oh, for a second I thought we had like a hidden path maybe, but no. I don't know where the hell these chests are at. Is this Mercio? Three days on watch with no sleep? I was ten freaking minutes late! It's not like the mine is gonna fall apart! Hey, uh... Sure, whatever! If you got business here, go on in! Yeah, we'll do that. <laughs> They'll pay for this! Alright, well... Uh, since we're outside of Murky, I'd say this is probably a good spot to wrap up for now. But, either way, we will continue on and tackle Murkyo tomorrow, so stay tuned, and we'll see you guys then.